Hi, everyone. Um, thank you so much for tuning in. I wanted to come on line today to just take you all on a little meditation journey or a journey that can actually bring about some peace and healing within all of you. And I felt that if we all did it together at the same time, we could probably bring about some kind of calm to the planet, um, maybe even to our world leaders and all the people that need it. What we're trying to do is bring about calm and healing during these turbulent times, because it's not just about um, viruses and, and things like that and about illnesses, but it is also about staying calm so that we're not stressing our systems even more than necessary. Many of you I know are panicking and you're panicking because we are, you're feeling that we're in an uncontrollable situation or we're in uncharted territory. So many of you who've written to me have said you're handling it calmly, but you're surrounded by people who are not and people who keep bringing messages to you that make you feel overwhelmed. So what I wanted to do is regardless of what situation you're in, regardless of where you are in the world, I wanted to bring you something that will just help you to get grounded and expanded wherever you are and whatever you're doing. So before I start, um, if you need a couple of minutes to get yourself ready, I'm going to request um, that this meditation or this journey, we'll call it a journey because I think it's deeper than a regular meditation. This journey is going to take about 20 minutes. So I want you to start getting comfortable. Grab a glass of water. You have a few moments to do that and uh, put, it, put it next to you so that when you come out of it, you can have some water ready. Get into a position that's comfortable. If you're in your car, don't do this now. You can do it when you get home. So this is, this is going to serve two purposes. One is you can listen to this anytime when you feel you need to calm yourself down. Number two is if for those of you who've tuned in live, um, all of us doing this at the same time right now, will hopefully make a shift, at least some kind of a small shift or a dent somewhere in the planet. So, so, though, so basically it's to heal ourselves and it's to heal the world or to help heal the world. <clears throat> Excuse me. So um, I, I'd like you to be able to get into a position that you feel you can maintain comfortably for the next 20 minutes. You don't have to be lying down or seated. I mean, there's no particular position, but whatever it is that you can maintain for the next 20 minutes would be great. And then I'm just going to take you on a guided journey. And this journey is going to work for you whether you are good at visualizing or not. Um, I will, I will, you know, some of you are more auditory, so you will take it in as audio. Some of you are more visual and immediately pictures will form. Some of you are more knowledge based. So just take it in and listen to the music. The music is courtesy of Barry Goldstein, very beautiful music that we've selected. Um, and, uh, and many of you know that I've worked with Barry many times before on, um, and his musical creations are very healing. So this meditation is, first of all, the music itself will alter your brain waves and your cells to actually um, heighten your, your healing. It, it actually helps to expand your, um, or to increase your immune system. In other words, it actually alters you at a cellular level. Um, Barry is a sound healer and he designs his music that way. They are for healing and they have been used in hospitals. They have been used for cancer patients. Um, so, so we have specifically chosen Barry's music for that reason. So the music itself is healing. Um, the words that I have chosen for this is to help you to expand your energy so that it not only increases your own immunity, but it increases the immunity and the energy and the chi and the prana of anybody who enters your energy field. So this is the purpose of this meditation. And the more of us that do it, the more we can create this energy field, not just around us, but for the people around us and for the world at large. So when you're all ready, I would like us to get started. Um, 
I'm not going to get into too much of, I'm not going to get into questions and answers or into too much of my views on what's going on or anything today. Tomorrow, I will be on again online and I will speak again about the topic. But today, I would like it to just be a peaceful journey. And I'm going to ask you all to get out of your mind, get out of your brain. When our minds get out of the way, our energy and our bodies can be incredibly powerful. So just sit and relax, sit very, very comfortably, and we can start the music now. And I would like you to close your eyes if you wish. If you prefer to keep your eyes open, do so. But if it makes you feel more relaxed to close your eyes, please do so. Now I'd like you to start to completely relax and become aware of any part of your body where you're feeling any tension. Start from your crown area. If you feel any tension in the area of your crown, just release it. Feel the cells just releasing any stress and tension around your head, your jaw area. Feel the muscles around your jaw just relaxing and releasing the tension. Now feel it around your forehead and your eyes. Just feel all the tension just being released and melting away. Now feel the area around your neck becoming completely relaxed. And your shoulders just releasing the tension and becoming completely relaxed. Now slowly move down your body, down your arms and your chest area. Feel your breath going in and out. in and out. Feel yourself releasing any tension that's within your body. As your focus shifts down your body, feel the tension releasing from your hands and your fingers and also from your lower back, your hips, your thighs and move all down your legs, your calves, your ankles, your feet, your toes. Just watch all that tension just melt away. Feel yourself becoming so limp and relaxed that if someone were to lift your arm right now and let it go, it would fall right back down. Don't use any of your own energy to hold yourself up right now. Allow whatever it is you're sitting on to support your entire weight. Just allow yourself to be limp. Allow yourself to be a passenger. Allow yourself to be a recipient of what is to come. You just have to receive and open yourself up to receiving now. light coming from above and entering your head through the crown. If you're able to visualize it, that's great. If you're not a visualizer, that's okay. Just know that there is a beautiful light coming down from above and entering you through your crown. Allow that light to take on any color that it chooses. Absolutely any color. It can
can be a combination of colors. It can even be a rainbow. Whatever it chooses, allow it to choose itself. Don't choose it for it. Don't use your mind right now. Allow it to choose itself. Allow it to choose its own color or colors. And see that light going down through your head as it enters through the crown and it travels down and down your throat. And as it's traveling down, it's cleansing everything path. It's cleansing the inside of your head, your sinuses, the back of your throat, your thyroid area. And as it travels down from your throat towards your heart area, it's bathing your heart in its beautiful warm energy. Just bathing your heart as it continues to travel down, it now fills your lungs with the beautiful light. As it fills your lungs with beautiful light, it strengthens your lungs. Feel your lungs becoming stronger with this light. Allow that light to remain in your lungs now and swirl around. Just bathing it, bathing your lungs, bathing them and strengthening them. As you breathe in and out, feel your lungs getting stronger with every breath. Just feel it and know it and know you have the power within you to be as strong as is needed for you to live out your life fully and purposefully. Now feel that energy and see that energy and that light continue to travel down your body and into your kidneys. Feel your kidneys being filled with beautiful, radiant life force energy, cleansing it and strengthening it. And now it's also traveling through your stomach and your spleen and your intestines. And allow it to continue traveling down into your reproductive organs. If there are any areas of your body where you have either recently been facing challenges or are facing health challenges, allow this energy to really bathe that area. Allow yourself to linger in that area longer now before continuing to travel down. I'm going to give you the next minute or so to allow yourself to linger in the area of any area in your body where you may have recently faced challenges or be currently facing challenges. See that light bathe that area with healing energy and see that area as being fully healed already. I'm going to allow you in silence now.
change colors, that's fine too. Allow it to travel down through your legs, down to your feet, bathing every part of your body. And as it reaches the soles of your feet, I would like you to imagine this beautiful light going down into the ground. If your feet are pointing upwards, if you're sitting with your legs up and your toes are pointing upwards, then see this light going down from the back of your heels into the ground. And if your feet are flat on the floor, see the light coming out from the soles of your feet and going down through the ground. And whether you are in a building or a house, see it traveling all the way down, down through your house or your building, into the ground, into Mother Earth. As it travels down into Mother Earth, watch this light sprout roots, big, strong, light-bearing roots, bright, filled with energy, life force energy, your life force energy, firmly rooted into this earth. You are here for a reason. You have a purpose. You yet have a lot to fulfill. You are committed to being here. And as a result, you are firmly rooted to this earth and yet connected to the universe above. See the roots growing downwards, widening as they sprout more roots, keeping you firmly and strongly entrenched in this earth. You're not going anywhere for now. See that energy, and as it goes into the earth, it encounters the roots of other beings who are currently doing the same thing. Because as your roots are spreading, it is reaching towards the center of the earth and meeting with the roots of other beings. And now your roots are entwining, intertwining with each other, strengthening each other, enforcing each other, because we are in this together. It doesn't matter where in the world we are. It doesn't matter whether you're in Italy or England or France or Greece or India or China or Hong Kong or America or Canada or Australia or New Zealand or Africa. It doesn't matter. We're all energy beings. We are all light beings filled with light, life force energy that transcends time and space. We are all in this together. We are all intertwined. And you are intertwined at your roots. And now I would like you to take yourself up to the crown for a moment and see the light that's coming from above light as you look up to see where the light is coming from you see that even at the crown as it travels up it has created a huge aura and the light of everybody else is also coming from the same place because we are all connected from above and below. Now, I would like you to be able to see your whole body. Visualize your whole body if you can, if you're good at visualizing. Otherwise, just know this. As you look at your whole body and you have allowed it to be filled with this light, this life force energy. Your body is now glowing. 
Your body is glowing with this aura. And I want you to see this aura or imagine this aura or know that this aura is there and it is expanding. And I want you to know this aura is expanding now. And if you can visualize it, visualize this light that is traveling down through you now getting bigger and bigger so that the aura it's casting is getting bigger and bigger. Watch this aura getting bigger and bigger so that it is now bigger than the room you're in. It is now bigger than the house you're in. This aura, this energy is pure life force energy. It is pure consciousness. It is who you really are. It is more powerful than anything. It is the God force in you. It is a piece of God. It is the piece of God in you that has chosen to express itself through your physical body. This is the time to know how powerful that is. It is far more powerful than you have been led to believe. It is far greater. It reaches more places and more people in its purity and in its light. This beautiful light, I want you to see it now expand. And I want you to see it reach all the places and the people who you physically at this time are unable to go and see and reach. I want you to see your life force energy expanding so much. As I said, beyond your house, it could be beyond your neighborhood. I want you to see it bathe your neighborhood. Bathe your neighbors with your light. See it expand. Allow it to bathe the hospitals in your area, the people who are quarantined in their homes, in your town, in your city. Allow that energy to keep expanding right now. Visualize areas that you want it to reach. Visualize the areas you want bathed in your beautiful life force energy. It could be your parents' or your grandparents' homes. Visualize your energy expanding to reach them. Bathe them. Bathe your loved ones. If you are a healthcare worker, bathe all your patients in this beautiful light. That light is you. That light is who you truly are. That light can be as expanded as you want it to be. That light is your life force energy. And life force energy has no limit. Life force energy is beyond time and space. You need to know this and believe this. You always have it. You always did, but you didn't know. You always have it. You always have access to it. And you can use it for anyone around you. So keep seeing it expand and bathe everybody around you in it. See your loved ones. Just see them now. Visualize them now. Your children, your grandchildren, your parents, your grandparents, your friends, your neighbors. See them being bathed in your energy and being uplifted. See them smiling and not realizing what affected them. Just feel it. 
feel what that feels like. I'm going to allow you to feel that for the next minute or so. your arms and give yourself a nice big tight hug just give yourself a tight hug I so appreciate all of you who stayed through this journey and I want you to know that this energy won't go away anytime soon and whenever you're feeling that it's going to fade or to go away just replay this video, re-listen to it. You don't have to watch the video, you can just listen to it. Um, this is for you to use as often as you like and it will stay with you. And what I would love is I would love your feedback and I would love for you to also um, start to notice what changes take place during your, the course of your day or night or the course of your life after, after you have done this after you've done this journey. So maybe in 24 hours or 48 hours or whenever, you can revisit this thread, this video, whether you're on YouTube or Facebook, I would love for you to come back and revisit this and to put in the comments any experiences that you've had. Like if you've experienced some changes in your environment or in the people around you or something great happened or a healing or anything, I would love, love, love to hear from you. If for any reason you're experiencing something that is unsettling, don't worry, don't fear it because this, 
this meditation would have really shifted your energy. And if something unsettling comes up, it just means that you brought something up faster that was below the surface. It's come up for you to work through. It's all good. It's absolutely all good. It just means you're ready to work through it now and come out of it and be stronger and better than ever. That is the idea. It's for you to be self-empowered. It's, um, it's super important for you to be self-empowered and this is a great time to do it when things are happening outside that is beyond your control. Remember, you are a soul. You are a soul. You're not a role. You're not, you're not just this person in the body. You are a soul and you committed to being here. So remember that commitment. Stay with that commitment. Stay uplifted. You can still be responsible. You can still do all the right things and the sensible things and whatever it is that your government is guiding you to do. You can stick to all the guidelines, stick to all the rules. I don't advocate not following them. So please do follow all the guidelines, the government outlined guidelines for this, this, little vir this little crisis we're going through or whatever we want to call it. Remember in Chinese, the word crisis translates to opportunity. So, um, so uh, you, you can stick to all the guidelines. I'm not advocating not to do that, but it's also important to keep your, to keep yourself sane to keep yourself um, calm and to not panic. That is super important. And to know that you've got this, you've got this. So thank you so much, all of you for tuning in. And I will be back tomorrow with my friends, Sunny and Emmanuel, with lots of tips on how to keep energized and how to keep positive through all of this. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you all soon. Bye.